Ukrainian armed forces plan to turn winter into a weapon, 80 ACMS missiles will strike deep inside Russia. This winter, Ukrainian forces are planning missile attacks on Russian command centers, ammunition depots and supply lines deep within enemy territory. If the Ukrainian armed forces manage to disrupt the logistics of the adversary, the occupiers will literally get wet and cold. The New York Times reports, according to the publication, the Ukrainian armed forces aim to reduce the combat readiness of Russian troops. Notably, the ATA CMS missiles recently provided by the United States give Ukrainian forces the capability to strike Russian positions across the entire occupied territory. Furthermore, every kilometer of advancement by the Ukrainian armed forces in the south creates new problems for the occupiers. However, as mentioned in the article, Russia in 2023 has learned to adapt much better to combat operations than last year. Russia may attempt to change supply routes or use its artillery and aviation to counter the bombardment by Ukrainian forces, according to analyst Jack Watling. If Russian troops are drawn into the defense along a wide front, then Russian forces will be outside, getting wet and cold. If targeted strikes can degrade their logistics, then the limited training and field craft of Russian forces can maximize climactic injuries, he explained. In turn, Russian forces will target the civilian energy infrastructure of Ukraine.